Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you a list view point with the array item uh, as a item source uh, in UWP. So, so this is the simple tutorial uh, I'm providing you um, a list of array how to bind with the uh, list view uh, as a item source property. So as usual, first of all add stack panel and after that you can add the list view okay in the code behind file uh, I mean to say in the C sharp file uh, I will bind it okay now the name is list11 that is ls1 and the header is uh, color chooser and selection changed property when we uh, select any one uh, uh, item from the list view then uh, get uh, uh, open a um, pop-up window and uh, display some text message on the screen string create is uh, create some um, uh, create an array with uh, list of colors that is green blue in double quotes and red okay rgb color and get the list view by using ls one dot x name property uh, list one dot item source is colors okay now after buying that if you want to uh, get item selected item you can do the uh, you can do it here uh, list view l l1 equals to sender uh, sender uh, actually this code is uh, similar with the previous one because uh, uh, I want to get the item from the list view so string list uh, selected item and uh, l1 dot l1 dot selected item okay selected item dot to string and display that message on the message dialog so message dialog is a class in the U uh, uwp so you can use the message dialog class and show synchronized method that is asynchronous method available in uh, c sharp for the uwp message dialog in previous video uh, uh, I'm using uh, I was uh, I did use async method uh, without await keywords okay so message dot show asynchronous asynchronously method is used with the await keyword and the async keywords so async use and okay and here we you can use a wait okay that's fine and run it your program so thank you very much for watching this video